Hello and welcome back to Home Renovation Experts. Steve here. So, we've all done it, we've all had it. You kind of walk down the stairs and it turns out you catch a little bit of lick, lip on this and you tear it off and you end up with like a few bits and pieces just like that, which you don't really want. So, how do you repair it? A couple of ways, and this is my favorite way. So first of all, I position these back on there just to make sure which bit is going where so that I've got a rough idea about what's what. So there you can see that definitely goes on the top like that. And then one will go underneath it. So what I do then is, scratch the back of my head because I'm empty. I will then take Mitofast, or it, I'm not brand supporting here, it's just it happened to be the one that was on sale at screw fix and they had it in stock. So that along with the glue. So basically it's super glue. So I'll put that on the actual joint, on that bit of wood there. Then I'll bring my two pieces of little baby wood, which is just over here. That's the way they're facing. So that's face up, so I'll turn them over, spray the activator on the back, and then push it into place. And I'm gonna try and do this on camera and see how it goes. So basically, I'm just gonna put that in the joint where both bits need to go. Like I say, it's basically super glue. Make sure it's going right into the joints where I'm going to need it. Okay, looking nice. Done. Happy days. And what I'll do now is, and then the top bit is the first bit I want to start with. So, give it a spray. Get it positioned, lined up. Push it on quickly where I know it needs to go. Just pin it, hold it, and this mite stuff is bloody brilliant stuff. So that's got that already. Done and dusted. Do the same for this bit. And it'll now go on to there like so. Give it a good old push, make sure it's staying where it needs to stay. Like I say, give it a couple of seconds to kind of do its thing. And that's it, that is it officially glued in and that is never going anywhere because that stuff holds it like a mother. Now, when it comes to these little joints and bits and pieces here, I'm gonna use this thing called beeswax, which is like a hard wax, but it'll come in, I've got some in a van, it, it kind of has different shades of colors as it runs through. So I can pick the one that's closest to this handrail and you literally just take a bit off, get it moving in your hand a little bit and then rub it in. Or alternatively, if you've got a close enough color, you can just like rub the, the edge of it in there. But I'll show you how to do that in a minute. I said, that's set, I'm gonna let it harden off, go for do another little job I've got to do in here, and then I'll come back and show you me finishing that. Right, so I've got the wax. So this is stuff that I managed to get hold of. Bri wax, filler sticks, and basically, so in this packet you're like four different colors, possibly applicator, which I won't use, but there you go, that's what it is. Quite hard, but brilliant stuff. So all I need to do now is, uh, just have color done a little bit, so literally, I'm just gonna wipe it against the grain just to fill up the gap. Please mind the gap. So I'm just gonna force that in there. I'm gonna do that all the way around the joint. Just making sure I work it right in. And as you rub it, it kind of, it doesn't melt melt, but it becomes a bit more pliable. And like that, you can see it kind of filling in the hole now. And then, once I'm kind of happy, so you can see it now. Not too sharp, I'll sharpen it up, let's just see, there we go. So there you go, that's not looking too bad at all. And then, what I'll do, actually, do you know what, I'm gonna do this little corner bit as well. Seeing as I'm here, Rub that in there like that. All right, and then what I'm gonna do is grab some black scratch. So here's the black scratch I was talking about. So it's just furniture scratch basically. So it gets around like your posts and stuff like that. Brilliant, brilliant gear. So all I'm gonna do now is just give it a little light rub. Just to remove the wax where it doesn't need to be.
So that's basically it. How nice is that? Doesn't take long. So what I'll do is I'll give it a fine little lick over there. So I'm gonna go and get a bit more wax. There's a tiny little joint. I don't know if you can see it. Just there. So I'm gonna just fill that little bit. But apart from that, that is how you do it. It's simple as that. And then when I've kind of rubbed it, if this looks a bit duller, because obviously I've been scratching it up a little bit, I'll just get a very light piece of um, varnish. Just lick that one piece over. Done and dusted. And that's how you repair a bit of wood and damage to your woodwork.